Hey guys, how are you? Daniel here at the Phoenix Airport. I am getting to my gate after my last planning session of the year. Uh, we're doing a planning session for a marketing company that we've been working for two years. And they do Moneyball for TV ads. A very few people use TV ads. So there's a lot of great opportunities in TV that rarely people see it. But there's, if you, if you sell HVACs or lawyers and all these kind of things that you go to the base of the pyramid, they still watch a lot of TV and they watch a lot of TV and games and the rest. So, so still a great, great market. And because there's so few advertisers, usually you could get really, really good prices to buy leads. So it's been a lot of fun to work with them. And they really do Moneyball and they tell you exactly with eight, what's the best ad for your to buy leads. So like, I don't know if you remember in, in Moneyball, they were buying, right? How many bases, what the cheapest cost to get someone a base? These guys said, hey, What's the cheapest to get you a qualified lead for what you want? And sometimes tell you, yeah, the ad at two o'clock in the morning, because it costs $5 to run an ad, could get you a cheaper qualified lead at those hours than on the TV news of 8 a.m., right? Because that ad costs you, let's say, $500. So it's really, really important to understand your product and really understand where it goes placed. But what I like about what happened, and it happens a lot every planning session that we do, is the clarity that it comes from doing a good planning of the next year or the quarter and the expectations. People said, now I understand what my boss expects from me or my leader expects from me. And that was amazing to get that clarity and really saying, now I know what I have to do. We have a lot of disagreement before we're doing double things and the rest. But once we start planning the year and we come out of these two days of planning uh, for the next of the year, everyone knows exactly what they have to do, what the team expects from them, and now they could build a plan to execute. So my question to you is, are you doing planning session? Are you planning for next year to have a great, great 2024? Take the time to plan, take this time to really think and build the priorities, the KPIs, the critical, the last words, uh, the success criteria of the KPIs to really have a plan that gives clarity, gives expectations, and peace of mind to the rest of your team so you could have a great, great 2024. Hope you have a great 2024. Probably this is my last video of the year. Uh, look forward to you next year.